Welcome back to Inside the Box. In this video, I'm going to show you how to close your eBay account. I'm not suggesting you do this. There could be a hundred different reasons why you're wanting to close your account. I love selling on eBay. I talk about it a lot on my channel. I talk about ways that you can make money with the skills and tools you already have, the things that are inside your box. So if that's interesting to you guys, make sure you subscribe and follow along. But today I am closing an eBay account because I had made a dummy account to do some tutorial videos and I want to close it now to show you guys how that works and so you can see the whole process through if you're trying to decide whether or not you want to close your eBay account. So we're going to start on eBay's main page. You're going to go to the top left corner underneath your name and you're going to click the drop down arrow and then click on account settings. Then on this page over to the right, you'll see account preferences. You're going to select the option underneath that says close account. This will take you to a two minute article. I suggest you read the whole thing. eBay doesn't want you to close your account. They talk about what will happen if you do. I will put the link to this article with my affiliate links in the description box below. If you're just wanting to stop selling, you don't have to close your account eBay says you can simply remove your automatic payment method or cancel your selling tool subscription. I looked into the removing the automatic payment method and I haven't figured out how to do that yet. If any of you guys know how to remove a bank account completely, please let us know in the comments below because I've received some questions about that. But eBay always suggests that you have the automatic payment method, so I don't know if there's a way to really permanently remove that. So if you really are wanting to close your account and you're not just wanting to stop selling on eBay, the other things to look at and consider are all your fees paid, do you have any bids on any items open, do you have any outstanding payouts that need to process to your bank account, because you don't want to close anything if there's any money transactions going on at the time. So once you go through the process of closing your account, they'll send you an email saying that they've gotten the request from you, and then you have up to 30 days to respond to that email. Also, it takes about 30 days for your account to be permanently closed. And once it's closed, you won't be able to access any history, purchase history, or anything from that account. So once you've submitted an account closure request, you won't be able to access your account or use it to buy or sell on eBay. You're going to be done with that account. You won't be able to get back on. So take time to read through this two minute article, all the fine print, make sure this is a decision you really want to make before you move on. I'm going to go ahead and move forward and click on the close account and delete my data. So that'll take you to the tell us why you're leaving page and here on the drop down arrow you have many different options to choose from and there's a lot of reasons you can see here why people might close their eBay account, security concerns, billing issues, account issues. For me it's just personal reasons. I just don't want multiple eBay accounts. I don't need this one. I was just using it for tutorial videos. So within the personal reasons, they have even more options to choose from. Maybe you're moving and that's why you're closing in your account. I imagine if you click on that, eBay will probably say, oh, you don't have to close your account. You can just change your address. Um, maybe you're worried that eBay is not safe. But again, for me, I'm just going to select other here. So again, they're giving you one last prompt. They really want you to keep your account open. It doesn't cost you anything to keep it open, even if you're not using it right now. And then it asks if this question solved your problem. I'm just going to select yes, but I still want to close my account. So before you can finally close your account, you read this one last prompt. So I have read all of this and I do understand it. So I'm going to click the I read and understand the above information box. And then I'm going to click on submit request. So that took me to the sign in page. So if I sign into the account, I will get a message now that says account will be closed. We've started the process to close your account. The process may take up to 30 days. Once your account has been closed, we will send an email to your registered email address. Thank you for being a member of the eBay community. So now I'm just waiting for that email to confirm that my account was closed. I'm going to show you what the email looks like after you submit your request that they sent you. So I thought I'd show you what that email looks like. Just to sum up real quick, they tell you that if you weren't the one to file that request, you can contact them immediately. You have up to 30 days to cancel the request of closing your account. 
but if you do not contact them, they'll continue to proceed to close it. The account closing process may take up to 30 days from this notice, and if you had an item that sold in the last 30 days, the account process might take up to 60 days to close within this notice. So that's just an overview of what this email looks like. I hope this was a helpful tutorial. Let me know if it was by hitting that thumbs up button. If, if you guys have any more questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you want more how-to videos like this, or if you're curious about ways you can make money with the skills and tools you already have, the things that are inside your box, make sure you hit that subscribe button and follow along with my channel. Thanks everyone, and I'll catch you in my next video.